it honestly brought me back these emotions. Whether they be good or bad, it was a beautiful, beautiful thing to be able to re-experience life. If you're one of those people that's been around since 1,000 subscribers, or whether you're brand new to the channel, I want to share with you some of the most important moments in my life. The moments that made me smile, that made me cry, the moments that gave me awe, and the moments that inspired me to want to travel, and ultimately have made my life over the past three and a half years the best life I could have ever asked for. One thing I need to say before we dive into Nostalgia Center okay. is thank you. Thank you so much. We are at 1 million subscribers, hand in hand, step in step. We were together for all of this. You guys literally mean the world. The bulldozer, the bulldozer, the bulldozer, the bulldozer, the bulldozer, 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 Ang aking asong bulldozer. Sige. Amazon gift cards. Don't get the codes. They're expired, but I'm just kidding. I actually have something nice to give. I would like to take one of you on a trip. I don't know where it's going to be yet. It might be here in Bali. Maybe it's somewhere in Europe or North America. I don't know. I will take care of all the planning, all the expenses, whether it be flights, visas, everything. The only disclaimer is you must be 18 years old. Uh, I can't take anyone under that age, so I hope you understand that. I want to hear from you in 30 seconds or less via an Instagram story. Just tag me at Lost of Blonde. What is it that makes you the most deserving? Whether it be that you've been around since 1,000 subscribers, whether it be that you've never had the resources to travel or you've always been too scared, any of these reasons, it's up to you. I'm going to put a close date down below here. So as long as you do that before that date, you are totally eligible as long as you're over 18. One of the things that I enjoyed to see the most out of watching my old videos was that feeling of progress. I mean, I go back to the old videos and obviously they were designed for a different purpose. They were never made to be entertaining a large audience. They were just a guy that was traveling and had a GoPro with him. You know, I, I didn't have a single photography bone in my body. I literally had no idea what aperture was. I didn't know any of this because it was never really part of my realm. It was never part of my life. But with time, it grew on me, and it grew on me really quickly. I became insanely obsessed with getting the best visual quality, but when I go back there and I look at where the video started, where they progressed as I started to invest myself in videography, in better equipment, investing time and money into getting better results, it's one of the things that I'm proudest about here on this channel. The thing that makes this job fun, always trying to be better, always trying to be bigger, fatter, and dadder. Now, progress wasn't just seen in the form of the way I shot my videos, it was also the branding. I want to show you guys where the Lost LeBlanc channel, formerly known as Christian's Travel Vlogs, started. 99% of you will be like, what is that? Here I am in university thinking to myself, what best represents what I am? It was being a pilot and going out there and doing the thing that very few others were doing. And so this bicycle is actually one of the first ever bicycles created. And I thought it looked pretty so cool. So for me, that was a good enough for you. Look at that. It for like all of, I don't know, maybe a month. <laughs> it didn't last very long. Part of the progress story. From there, I went with my good friend, Carly Fairbank. And then I designed this one. So it's a LeBlanc Lost LeBlanc. And this was the intro slide to so many of my videos back in, I believe, 2016. At the time, my Instagram, my Twitter, my Facebook, and my YouTube all had different usernames because Christian LeBlanc was not available across all of them. And so I started telling myself, I can't have four different social media tags. Tulug na na, matulug na! And so that's when I started to crack down on the, the future of this channel. Like I literally sat on this question for about two months. Mm, mm, I was working mm, with the ideas mm, of mm, Nomad mm, LeBlanc, mm, uh, mm, Vagabond mm, LeBlanc. When the word mm, loss came to me, it was immediate. Mm, she gave, and eventually I got it animated by somebody else that volunteered to do that. From day one, has been supported by the community, people doing things for free, people <laughs> helping <laughs> to get a very broad <laughs> road. And it's just incredible. <laughs> <laughs> it's just <laughs> in film, in branding. A lot of you guys know the Lost LeBlanc channel as the place to go for beautiful drone shots. And with that, we have had some... Hmm. Hmm.
time I would just like compile it all and make a beautiful video. If you want to see that, comment down below. Maybe I'll do that. As you guys know, on this channel, one of my favorite things is laughing. I love to laugh. It's probably something I live for the most. And on these travels, in these videos, I have always found a way to laugh. Whether it be laughing with somebody, sometimes laughing at somebody else's expense. I especially used to do that a lot. But as the channel grew, I kind of stopped doing that a little bit. But there's still been some absolutely incredible moments that I have found in all my old videos. And these are some of the moments that I wanted to highlight. What is this? Ah! Bulldozer. <laughs> Bulldozer. This water is just so blue. 
Gil ka talaga. <laughs> Takot ka. Sige. Ha, wala. Pagod ka? Shop ka na. Pagod na. Na, pagod ka? Ah, suke. Pagod ka. Sige, ikutin natin yung ano. Ikutin natin yung kama. Tama, pagod na ako. Jump, 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 Pagod ka, pagod na pagod. Ah, it's okay. Sit. Oops. Sit. Sit. Down. Good job. Good night.